The paper Windmill Theatre has just launched a new performance that includes a protagonist who stands five stories tall. The character is the largest inflatable prop the troupe has ever used. This statue of clairvoyant god Chen Li Yen reaches the ceiling at the National Theatre when it's slowly brought to the stage becoming upright with its fist rising high in the air many in the audience are quite amazed. There's also another inflatable character, the Claire audience god, Sun Feng Er. The Claire audience god is yet to arrive, but when these two come together, I think that they will fill the ceiling of the National Theater. Both are giant-sized inflatable sculptures that were built at a total cost of 1.4 million NT. Prior to each performance, it takes two hours to fill them with helium, which comes at a cost of 200,000 NT. Many are surprised that this theater troupe would spend so much money just to entertain children. One of the reasons is that we have many friends willing to support us. If we are able to let children see these supersized gods, then perhaps it will be able to further stimulate their creativity in the future. Another focus of attention today was the daughter of former AUO chairman K.Y. Lee, Li Yen Rong, who is a lawyer and a legislative candidate. She has been invited to serve as a first-time actor in this performance. When the chairman invited me, he said I like to help people. So he asked why I don't help some of these children. He said talk was cheap, but we should start at the grassroots and allow children to experience theater. Lee later agreed that it's not enough to visit markets and canvas for votes, deciding to take the stage and assist with this performance for local children. The performance will premiere at the National Theater on June 19th, and later tour Kaohsiung, Taichung, and Tainan.